Welcome to lecture number 64 and the final lecture of the series Unreal 5 for Arquis and in this lecture we'll learn how we can package this project. So let's get started. Packaging a project is actually pretty easy but first we have to download a few applications. Okay, so let's open a browser and first of all I'll search for Windows SDK. I'll select this link and I'll download the installer. Let's open it. It will pop up this application installer, specify the location and click next. And now you can click on this install button to install this application. Okay. I already have this application installed, so I'll press cancel. And I'll close this window. Next application that we need to install is Netcore 3.1. Okay. I'll select this link. and I'll click 64 bit. I already have this downloaded so I'll cancel it. Let's open this application installer. I already have this application installed so that is why it is showing this window. It's a pretty straightforward process. You'll just have to install this application just like you install any other application on your windows. Okay. One more thing that we need to download is we need to download Visual Studio. Okay, so I'll type in Visual Studio 2022. I'll open this link. I'll select this Community 2022 option. And it will start to download. Okay. I'll open this application installer. I'll continue. I already have this installed, so that is why it is showing me this window you will see something like this and in here what you need to do is you need to download this one development with C++ and you need to download this one as well .NET desktop development and one more thing that you need to download is you need to download this one game development with C++ and then you need to click the install button and that is pretty much it okay if you already have Visual Studio installed in your PC then make sure you update it okay for that you will need to launch Visual Studio, continue without a code, go into help and then check for updates. Okay. Let's close this application. I'll open Unreal Engine and now what we need to do is we need to reconnect those nodes that we disconnected to render our scene. So first of all I'll go into blueprints and I'll select this sliding window blueprint. I'll connect this node with this one and I'll connect this node with this one and I'll disconnect this node I'll connect this node with this one and I'll delete it let's compile this blueprint and now I'll go into the interactive walkthrough folder I'll open the blueprints folder and I'll open this bathroom faucet simulation blueprint I'll select this geometry cache component and I'll uncheck the running option Let's compile this blueprint. I'll close this window. Let's now open the interactive walkthrough blueprint. I'm going to connect this node with this one and I'll connect this node with this one. And I'll connect this node with this one. Okay. And that is pretty much it. I'll compile this blueprint and close this window. And one more thing that we need to do is we need to go into settings, project settings go into maps and modes and you need to select our project level in here okay I'll close this window I'll save everything and now I'll go into platforms I'll go into windows and first of all I'll select this option let's restart Unreal Engine and now what I need to do is I need to add a player start actor I'll go into get content, I'll go into basic and I'll add this player start actor. Okay. Let's rotate this on Z axis by 90 and make sure that the spawn player is set to default player start. Okay. Now I'll simply go into platforms, I'll go into windows and I'll select package project. Let's find a folder to save this package. 
and it will start packaging my project okay it may take some time so just be patient okay so the packaging is complete let's now open the folder in which we saved our package okay i'll open this folder i'll open the windows folder and let's open this application and as you can see that we have our entire project in here let's enter this bedroom and let's see if we can change the color of the floor yeah it is working let's change the bed frame color yeah this one is working as well let's go into the living room and yeah there we are let's go into the bathroom let's see if we can run this fluid simulation yeah it is working okay let's go back into the bedroom And let's see if we can switch on these lights. There it is. Yeah, as you can see that it is working. Okay. If you are unable to package this project or if you have some errors, please feel free to ask any questions in the comment section. So that is the end of this lecture and the series. Thank you so much for following this series to the end. I hope you learned something from this series that will help you in the near future. If you learned something from me, please don't hesitate to subscribe to the channel and follow me on Patreon. So once again, thank you so much for sticking to the end and goodbye.